All right, Alex Heckman, we're inside the beautiful old landmark here in downtown Dayton that everyone is proud of around the Miami Valley. The old courthouse dates back to 1850, and it's one of the finest examples of Greek Revival style architecture anywhere in the United States. And I don't think a lot of folks know from Montgomery County. I mean, this was the Montgomery County Courthouse. Everything was done in here. Absolutely. All of your civil court, criminal court, probate court was all done in one building. The building, when it opened, was believed to be able to last for Dayton for decades. As things turned out, it didn't work out that way. The population grew so much and there was so much judicial process to undertake that they needed multiple courtrooms. So if you'd stop doing crimes out there, people, we would still be in this building. But now talk about speaking of crimes. Trials were in here and all that kind of stuff. And you guys are kind of bringing that back. Absolutely. One of the things that Dayton history strives to do is to bring history to life. And so we're going to be presenting old case files this coming weekend and the following two weekends. And uh, the idea is that to bring a, a historic trial to life. This year we're bringing to life Ohio versus Harry Adams. So it's a murder case from 1876. So this will give people an opportunity to learn about Dayton in the 1870s. It'll give you an opportunity to learn about the criminal justice system, all of those types of things. And it actually happened right here. It happened right here. The case, the script itself is pulled directly from the newspaper accounts from the time. The characters that are in the production are real life, true characters. So this is as much as possible as an authentic courtroom experience from the 1870s. And you pick jurors out of the audience, right? So folks come down to watch, they get picked to be on the jury. Absolutely. So it, it really is a, a situation where you decide, the audience decides guilt or innocence. It's just $12 per person or $10 for Dayton History members. And uh, prepaid reservations are preferred, but you can also buy tickets at the door. WDTN.com. Go to Bookersby for more information. Folks, you decide whether guilty or innocent. And before we sign off here, we should probably, let's just have the judge do it. Let's do it. Let's judge. Have the judge decide. Take it away. Booker, you're guilty as charged. Court is adjourned.